Alright, <coughs> I think it's a good time to start. Blah. Uh, what have I done? We haven't done anything. It's a good time. Okay, we're back. Well, where do we want to move our webcam? I don't know. Let's move you down here. Yeah, we've been looking at some Metroidvania games to play lately. And a whole bunch of them just could not get to work with um, key bindings and well, not key bindings, just controllers. It's funny, I check all these other games work. And yeah, Menorah and um, Last uh, Last Vigil. No luck. So let's test this one out. So I like the art style of this one at least. I don't know anything about the story though. Last we meet. I can hardly believe it, yet here you are alive. No, I cannot hear your voice. I can hear, see your writing though. Kind of reminds me of Child of Light as well. God, that game was fun. You seem to be awake. And none the worse for wear. Oh. Oh, what the fuck? Did I frighten you? You can thank the priestess for my incorporeal form. Do you remember what fate befell this land? So you've lost your memories as well. Let us be rid of this place for now. It may be the best for you to see the state of things outside for yourself. Oh cool. So I can summon him to attack for me. Why does nothing? Oh, my dodge is a bit just dumping on the ground. Okay, that's a hit. That's a heal. Can't destroy anything here. Whoops. So left trigger. Stone statues in the likeness of the white priestesses. The inscription below, intact, reads Priestess of the Dawn, while the ruined statue seems to have been one of the Priestess of the Wind. And that's locked. Okay, so we want to come back here later. Now I wonder... Oh no, I think right trigger's not too bad for... Oh, wait. That allows me, probably allows me to switch my weapon set. Cool. Yep. The jump. There's no diving attack yet. Headset working. Yeah, it seems good. Haven't dropped any frames yet. Wield my power as you can. Yeah, he's gone. Cool. So just they're dying in one hit. Destroy the bowels. I haven't seen anything, any destructible terrain yet. And I can't attack up. Can I jump and hit that? I can't. Woo! Okay. I'm not really dodging, just diving through them. Can I jump on that? Uh. 
Yeah, we got it. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so... It's a little bit harder to dodge during an attack. Oh, come on! What the fuck? Dear Singret, I want you to deliver the amulet unto the White Priestess. It's a necklace I bestowed upon all priestesses, but I've imbued it with a blessing. I'm certain the ward will protect her from the threat of the blighted. The wards can be broken and restored, but that is something only a priestess can manage. Count on you to see this through. Okay, so yeah. So as I can heal up to hold up to three heals. Okay, so interesting. Spirits. Oh, so I can have multiple attack spirits. That's pretty cool. Prayer. Jump. Dodge. Swim. We haven't done that yet. Switch spirits. Yeah. Cool. Part of an amulet worn by the white priestess, the tiny still glows for faint light. Wait, can I attach that or is that just permanent? That might just be permanent. I'll take so you that. Got your, you got your controller work now? No, I haven't! This is, um... This is a Wait, different this game. This looks like Hollow Knight, just with a, a, a an extremely um, white ghosted chick. Yes, pretty much. With, we a, big are sword, with a big ass sword. <laughs> well, she's not the one holding it, to be fair. <laughs> she summons a ghost to do it for her. We are playing the Tim Burton of video games. It's like... It's like every other... <laughs> <laughs> I can't say it. <laughs> oh. But yeah, now there's a few games I want to play, but the controllers are not working. So the question is, do I just try to play on the keyboard, which would suck, or do I, like, eventually find a workaround? Oh, how come they weren't working? No idea. Every, a whole bunch of my other games worked. It was just them. Oh. So I don't know what to do. Um, Maybe it's not controller um, optimal or whatever. Well, they've... I obviously had issues with it, I can tell, but yeah, it kind of does suck. I'll have to ask so Paul. A, so is this a, is this a Hollow Knight ripoff or yeah. a roguelike of um, Dead Cells? No, nah, they're what, what they call Metroidvania, so basically they're a combination... Metroid, oh, Metroid, Metroidvania, yeah. Yeah, so that's what Hollow Knight is, and this is pretty much following that same line of, sign of things. Oh. But I don't know, because um, yeah, a whole bunch of them I've got that are like that, but... um. See, I don't mind these 2D graphics. But, um, yeah, just some of these indie games are just so fucking poorly optimised. Oh, well. But, yeah. Ooh, what's this? Respites. Act as checkpoints. Resting will store your HP with your spirit and prayer uses. Oh, what? I could only call... Okay, this is a fucking Hollow Knight thing. We rest on a bench, but uh, memories. I don't even remember doing the prologue. Oh, that's right. I might have skipped it all while I was trying to work out how to do this game. So, how you doing, Brownie? All right. Just been cleaning. Um, today we had to go to the uh, Wicked Witch's place. Um, Which is the britches? No, um, my grandmother's place. Um, she was nice last time I met her. Yeah, to, to other people, um, to direct family members, she was a bitch. Oh, fair. Um, and um, but she's nice as part of the grand to the to the kids. So well, that's the main thing. That's it. Um. We did that, and I'm just sort of just, yeah, resting for the big day tomorrow, which is going to be, um, 
Christmas. Pretty full on. Yeah. Um it'll be a big day, so just getting some just getting some rest in. Well I can. They are blighted whose minds do not fade. There is no saving grace, however, as it's said that they must endure an eternity of pain and suffering. The miracle of the white priestess is the only true salvation for those who came to be cursed with blight. Well, we'll see how you go. We'll see how it goes. I'm not looking forward to tomorrow. I'm like, ugh. You don't even have to do anything. Yeah. You just have to, you just have to rock up to a place to eat. <laughs> that is true, but... And you I, get to see your nephews, which you adore. I do, but I risk getting coronavirus. Oh, come on. Mate, if you haven't... If, if your body is immune by now, then... Uh, then you've just got the latest drug. <laughs> Man, it's funny, I could be so sick and yet, like, I can't. I've put with the only person I know that's never gotten the virus. I don't know why everyone else um, failed to avoid it. But well, all... I, reckon, I reckon I've had it even though I haven't tested it, because when Sue's got it, um, I had, like, exactly the same, like, symptoms and shit, but I never had. I didn't have the. I, it still came up negative. Which is really weird, so. But. Uh, as my sister keeps parroting, um, they're not 100% accurate, so I reckon I'll probably add it. Fair enough. Alrighty. That was a question I was going to ask you as well. What's that, the, honey? The Jabba Darby. The what? The Jabba Darby. They killed the Yacht. What? How do you not know this? The Jabba Darby that killed the yacht. The yacht. What the fuck, what the fuck are you talking about? Well, I think I was pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me rephrase it again. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> uh, I was I was reading about the um, dark uh, forest theory and um, the strike first approach. And supposedly in Stellaris. Solaris, the Yacht, did a first strike on the Jabadari and they were like, fuck you guys, and went and blew them all up and killed them all. Oh, see, the problem with Stellaris is there might be a storyline, but it doesn't correlate at all with the game. Oh. And there are pre-made races, but it's not like a fixed story. So if there's story lore, it's probably it's probably built around the how the game works, but... Um, I've never read it. Well, there you go. Because I was wondering, someone had like a story. I didn't know if it was fan-made or not. Well, it might be fan-made. Um, I don't know. But there's not really a storyline. It's sort of all the uh, similar sort of thing. It, um, you invent space flight and then you just start building ships, expand and start destroying stuff. I haven't actually played it for a long time, but it's a... Um, I don't... I didn't... As much as like all the customizing stuff and that's in it, it's it gets to a point where it's just a very stally game where you're just sort of waiting for the end game crap to come in. I just can't be fucking waiting anymore. Ah, uh, fair enough. I did laugh at the guy that took over a um an alien an alien planet, turned them all into food, and then sold them back there. <laughs> sold it back to themselves. Yeah, there's a, there's a lot of weird shit you can you can do as a um, as a um, uh, as any of the races, it's it's actually pretty fucked. <laughs> oh god! All right, so we want how to war crimes the video game. Bang! Ooh, let's heal. Jeez, it's a fairly let big heal, isn't it? Parish Way 1. Carriers of the Rod appeared from the land of snow, bringing calamity to the land's end. Said to be the Ancients' Revenge, the Rot drove people to madness and transformed them into monstrosities. Carriers of the Rot came noted as the Blight. So basically, we've got Melania Scarlet Rot, which has slowly taken over the world. So you're obviously we're coming back to some of these areas. I want that, and I can't get it. Tainted by the Blight, never to die. We call those blighted creatures the blighted. I don't think I said that right. Okay, let's rest here. 
If for no other reason, so that I can get my one prayer back. Whoa. It's a nice looking game. Uh, okay, so he is... The nun! Oh, the air is thick with the rot of the blight. Take heed. Am I going to have a problem here with... To protect um... her, I must. Destroy, destroy... Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, she doesn't look too friendly. Ow. Yeah, they're gonna sit on top of each other. Fuck. Oh, fuck. It's too big there, so I'm gonna have to try to do it. Quickly heal. Come on. Let's go collide with the Oh, fuck. Damn. Whoops. Come on. Ow. Quick heal. We're just going to power through her. There's the first boss down. Okay, I lie. Jesus. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Oh, the, <laughs> the smugness when you said the first boss down, thinking this was going to be an easy game. Oh. Come on, Mark, you know that there are no such things as easy games anymore. Yeah. Fuck. One, dash. Oh! Uh -huh. Ow! Oh, thank god! <laughs> oh, that could have been bad! I was supposed to protect you. What the fuck is the Z button? Ban them and find out. I adore the priestess of the fount. She was our only hope against the immortal blighted. With unflinching resolve and a smile on her face, she optimized radiant tenderness. My sister's letter informed me that the priestess was in poor health. Hey, epi epitomized. That's what I said. <laughs> no, you didn't. You know you didn't. <laughs> I couldn't rejoice at the peace she brought at the cost of our own well-being. Moreover, I couldn't forgive myself for not being able to protect her as the Guardian. I don't think being sick is the Guardian's fault. No, it was my own sister who was chosen for that role. Oh, did I just kill my sister? In my darkest hour, I found solace in Lily, who was much like the... Oh, no! Okay, so Lily's dip is who I am. Even though I couldn't serve her as Guardian, at least I could do it as a protector. Then the rain began to fall. Cries of pain rang out in the distance. The chief guardian called it the reign of death. And I gave Lily sanctuary and took my weapon in hand. The rain never let up. Guardian Singret swings an iron bolt to attack surrounding enemies. Sub skills have a cooldown and limited number of uses, but can be used in conjunction with other skills. Sinkrid guarded the Sept to protect the White Priestess Lily, never ending bloodshed caused to be consumed by madness. Guardian Sleep. Ooh, I got an extra jump. Fuck yeah. Double jump already? Fuck, that's sweet. Your soul has been purified, no longer imprisoned by blight. See, I, never that memory that. I never get that. Most, all these, a lot of the games, like, they bring up um, double jump, like, really early, and it's like... What's the point? You may as well just give it as a starting thing. Everyone knows what fucking double jump is. Some games do it really well. Like, Control gave you double jump as the last ability, and it opened up the game massively. Oh, really? Yeah, but that, does that create the uh, the the biggest um, detractor of some games, which is um, backtracking? To a degree, yes. <laughs> but uh, Control was small enough in scope that you could. it didn't matter. 
Um, and Blasphemous, ironically, Blasphemous never had a double jump. I was waiting all game for it, and it never came. Oh. Now, what do I want? I need... Thanks. Well, that's outside. We don't want to go out there. We want to test out our double jump. I need more of this. <coughs> but yeah, I don't mind double jumps, but yeah. As long as it's like... A lot of these games are meant to be like no, backtrack. I'm, I'm, not say, I'm not saying I don't mind it. It's just like, like, all right, um, so like, like Met, the Metro Prime series. What was weird was they take away a double jump, and then, it, and then you get it back as like the first main upgrade. Yeah. Oh, that's dumb. Yeah. I, d I don't like. It's a bit. You know, it's a bit unfair to Metroid because since there's so many games, hmm. so they have to keep taking away their powers while in get like the single games. It's like um, they don't need well, to worry the about it. The first one, the first one was probably the worst one because it was basically from the exploding um, uh, station. You copped a bit of feedback and you lost everything. <laughs> um, but it was it was a case of that game was trying to sort of line it up with um, uh, Super Metroid, where you sort of you know the first couple of items you get are more ball um, uh, uh, bombs. Um, charge beam and all that stuff. So they did that with the first one. Metro Prime Two did a better, where um, it was the the race that you were fighting that stole it, stole all your upgrades, and actually made bosses um, uh, specifically around set upgrades, which was pretty cool. So like your double jump, it was that you had to fight, you had to fight the um, uh, uh, the. The, the, the jumping or whatever, which was basically a normal ink, but it was boosted by the the double jump power, which was really cool. Mm -hmm. um, but you got to keep basic stuff like your charge beam, your morph ball and bombs, and like all the basic stuff. So you didn't start with basically nothing. Oh, uh, what the fuck? Let's put 30. I like your Devil May Cry, the reason why he never uses any of his previous weapons from the other games. Yeah. It's like, oh, I'm just going to pick up new ones, what the fuck? I don't need to bring any of the old ones. He just doesn't oh, give a fuck. He just has them on his wall, so we know he's got them. I guess he just can't be fucking carry bothered carrying them. Or ah, oh. is it the same thing with like po with like Pokemon? Every time Ash goes to a new thing, he only takes a new area. He only takes a Pikachu, and the rest just get left behind. Yeah, and probably. Like, got, and he's like, got some re like really good bloody Pokemon. It's like, nah, we've got to experience new or something. Oh, I wonder if this is just to allow me to replay bosses, or... Or if I actually want to get something new out of this, hell. I wish I was given a warning at... oh fuck. <laughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> yeah, I would, no, it's a warning, it's like, oh, you want to replay this boss? I'm like, no. Oh shit, here it is anyway. <laughs> Uh, Whoops. What uh, the... Can we jump? Damn, I really want a really bad mind out. It doesn't do as much damage, does it? Oh, here we go. Ah, okay, it's... Dodge. Ugh. Doesn't do much damage. Does it look like it could dodge into that? Ah, oh, whatever. Well, at least we know what death looks like. 
I don't know what the point of that is. We'll come back to that later. Well, that was odd. I was like, what the fuck? I don't want to fight the boss again. The Reign of Death, Bringer of Blight. They are really using over the word blight a lot. I've heard it like 20 million times already. Yeah. Ah. Chaos has taken the villages long before even my arrival. But did the rain end them or the blighted? My bond yeah, with the priestess is. They, they really are saying anymore. blight a lot, aren't they? Yeah. May not be able to lead to charge in this form, but my blade is yours. It's our core mechanic. <laughs> Don't look so surprised. You think me some sort of wretch to leave a child out in this horrid rain. Let us trudge on. This is like a gothic version of Child of Light. Have we met before? It seems their cognizance faded before succumbing to madness. You're going to have fun saying that word every time, aren't you? Which one? Cognitive. It's had a Z in it. Oh, cognizant? Cognizance. <laughs> Grower's letter. Thank you for your continued service ferrying the White Priestess and her guardians. My son hopes to one day be as fine a coachman as you, to ride as gallantly on a horse as a finer horse as you. Please call on us when you visit the parish. Blessed the Tranquil White Light, Grower Chief Guardian. Do I want to hop on this already? Whoops. Well, we can't do anything with that horse just yet. Oh, fuck. I was taken in by these lilies here. I keep thinking I can't make jumps, but she does have a pretty lenient grab mechanic. What's up here? Nothing. Obviously, we'd be replaying some of these areas a bit. Oh, fuck. Yeah, they got two bars. I wonder... Red and white flowers. You may find flowers blooming with mystical power to help on a journey. Red flowers. Light weathered red flowers will restore spirit uses and white flowers will restore prayer uses. Okay, no sound for doing that. Oh, there's a red one up there. Lol. Okay, that's pretty cool. Now it's just plus one. You can still tell this is a very tutorial wish at the moment. Wait, did that work? It did. I leveled up. I don't know what leveling up does in this game so far. Does it do anything? It might. I think it maybe just increases my stats. Level 3. Off that. Oh fuck that hit. Ow. Okay, sweet. I can actually um dodge him midair, that's good. Ah. Feel these white flowers, I really do.
I do expect me to take some damage, I'm guessing. I do like how I can switch between... I can have a couple of different, um... Loadouts. Oh fuck, that was dumb. That was really dumb, I don't know why I did that. Oh, what's up here? Nah, can't get up there. Can I break this? I can't attack down. I've got no um, dive attack yet. out of them. Shit. I probably could have avoided them, but I want the experience. Oh, what? I'm gonna squeeze it in and cut it off. That was a mini boss? This pain is unbearable. Time to purify the slug. Clipside Hamlet Youth. Perform an arc leap and lands with enough force to scatter and damage surrounding enemies. Separated from his mother in the midst of a terrible storm, the boy set off for the White Parish in search of help, but he never arrived. Oh, that was an actual human? Lol. He'll turn into a slug. Oh, motherfucker. Whoops. Uh, can I equip it here? Yeah, only had a respite, that makes sense. Okay, anything over this way? No. Oh man, I have to show you a jewelers game later on as well. I beat a guy that had a special revenant and a soul grimoire. Oh, a Defy Crescendo and, um, fucking two shadow dancers. Oh, Jesus. So he pretty much had a, um, the, the, the normal, um, expected, um, starter deck for, um. Yeah, I was lucky he didn't have any more spectral revenants. He only had the one, but fucking hell. Yeah, it still would have been brutal. Fuck. <laughs> I still haven't come across the cantor yet, and I'm. Pretty happy Haven't you? Oh, I got smacked by a Varth that just basically, um, what did he do? Elucidate a greater fortitude, and the finishing thing was a, a bloody Macanta, and I was like, oh god. Supposedly, a guy's deck at the moment, which I heard's good, it's the one hit KO. So the combo is, um, what's it? That what's that one that um, allows you to get out a creature for two less mana? Pijada. Oh no, it's a spell. So you cast a spell. Oh, Flash Reincarnation. You want Flash Reincarnation, Elucidator, Replication, and I think that's... Uh, maybe you need one more spell to get the combo. Uh, maybe Greater Fortitude, that would get it up to 7 damage. Well, that would, that would mean you do 21 damage. Pretty decent. Yes. <laughs> So what, you just stall the game out until you've got those cards in your hand and nine mana? Yeah, it is magma. If anyone could do it, it's either them. Ooh, fast travel available. Uh, spirits. Let us attach the... Uh, relics. Can't, relic can we can't enhance. Patch the Stone of Triumph. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is pretty cool. I should like this one maybe more. Yeah, the one I won last night was... Um, I was playing a Vitruvian guy. I managed to get um, four Blazing Spines out on the board. Ah. 
And then for some reason, uh, like, so I managed to sort of um, stifle him into the corner. Um, just like, so, but then he moved out, played a couple of things, and I'm like, look, and I'm like, so he moved to a square where three of my blazing spines can hit him. Oh, that's not good. And I've got a snow piercer in my um, hand as well for the extra damage I need to kill him. Huh. Then let's kill him. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> it was it was very it was very odd. I was like I was I was like sitting there just like hang on a second, hang on, hang on. What the fuck am I looking at here? <laughs> um. Uh, yeah, that. I will say I am enjoying that a lot of the legendaries that became that I didn't see because they got power creeped out. It's good to see them back being used again, like Voice of the Wind. Voice of the Wind. Whenever you play another minion, summon a um, a weird thing. Oh. It's really good in um, like a swarmy deck. Oh, nice. What a deep forest and almost entirely submerged. Was I meant to go up or down? You know what? We'll stay down for now. Oh, fuck. Uh, okay, that's uh. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, the fight cloud of death. Oh. Okay, they got all got different spells, that's pretty cool. Is he dead? Ooh, I leveled up. What's he gonna climb with? Ah oh, no! He's up there! Oh, damn, I can't fix that. Okay. Whew. Oh, fit this, though. Oh, the witch's it. thicket. Oh, shit. Oh, what the fuck? Do a quick heal. Oh, okay. Must have been just night time because I haven't got that around the uh, uh oh. Okay. That's an issue. Okay, I'm all out of healing. But there's still so much to be done. Stacking up blight times 10 can be used to enhance skills. Filthy residue shed by purified blighted. The sorrowful muck is stagnant but glints with a faint light. Allows you to enhance your skills that respires. Well that's cool. I'm gonna change the music as well. Oh fuck. I can attack from the water? That's pretty sweet. I don't know if I could dive underneath though. Do I kill him or do you teleport? Uh. Oh fuck. Oh, that's an issue. Uh, uh, I'm all out of healing. So I just need to funnel the water into something. Uh, oh, actually, I'm gonna do that. Double. Triple, actually. Let's go back around. Oh, thank goodness. Well, that was lucky. I'll take it. Oh, was I meant to go up? Oh. Can I get back up? Alright, I need a little bit more power, I feel. Oh my god.
Ah, fucking hell. Interesting area. Uh, so. Do we feel like upgrading anything? Uh, enhance. There we go. Alright, so we've got the hydrogen overload as tradition. Did I just... Yeah, so I've already enhanced that. I don't know about these others. I like it yellow cubes, oh, which is the titanium crystal. No. It's fine, because that is the next. So how much do I need? I need... Okay, so I need ancient souls to upgrade my Umbral Knight. But less for that. So much do I have? Let's, en let's enhance her. So if I went this way... Jesus Christ, what the fuck? What's going on here? I'm going in with my coal production. Why have I, my controller stopped working? Right. What the fuck? Oh, good idea. Well, that's odd. Wait, it's even got a sleeping spot like, um,. Hollow Knight. Yeah. Jeez, the ripoff is strong with this one. Oh, now my character works. What the no, fuck? No, no offense. <laughs> yeah, what does Metroid? She just hops in. She turns into a little ball, doesn't she? Yes. What to save? Yeah. Nah, it's just a, uh, like save stations. Like, unless I got hit with some kind of stun spell, I don't know why, um... Uh... I'm going to have to use that so I can get the silicon. Um... Okay, now I leveled up, nice. I'll be back. Oh, fuck me, that was a long attack. Oh, you're not dead. Yeah, that's weird. I don't know why my thing um, stopped controlling. That was weird. Cliffside Hamlet. Seems this village was once... Oh, he's not going to continue. Every second attack I could get a little bit higher. Oh fuck. Oh no, I had a bit of air effect on that, that hit. But we'll go down to the witch's place. Oh, whoa, you're fast. Why are you so fast? Wait, I can't get up here? What? Oh, uh, we'll get... Okay, I can't stun him with that. Is that enough damage? It is now. Nah, can't get up there. Feels like I still need some mobility. Do I go up or down? Let's go down for now. 
Looks like my spell share, uh... Oh, what the fuck? Ooh, an amulet fragment. Plus 5 HP, part of an ant worn by the White Priestess. Now do anything to that? No. Alright, so... Just a small little secret. Oh man, I can't wait to unlock some kind of ranged ability I can aim. Although to be fair, they are quite weak. I can kill them in a couple of hits. Oh, can I time this? I can. Beautiful. Uh, hit me, really? Last heal. I do like that, that's actually really cool. So she's got a different attack depending on whether I'm using her as a jump. Can I do it the same with this dude? Fire slug in there. Hmm. Now we need to... Let's keep going down. Ah. Oh. <gasps> the girl who became a guardian lies underground. Oh, I can't really open that. I don't know how to swim under water either. I don't think I've unlocked that ability, so we'll have to come back here. Huh. So wait, does the level up actually do anything? I think it just increases like my uh, damage and attack and all that. Oh, is it just the normal stuff? I'd have to look up what else it does. Because at the moment, it's not, it's, like, it's not as if it's increasing the amount I heal or anything. Like, maybe there are items that have to be a certain level to equip. I'm not too sure. Oh, yeah, mate. I've already found a branching path, but I couldn't be bothered dealing with the bullshit which was witches. Excuse me. That. That. Awesome. Good. Actually, I am glad that I upgraded that girl to like swing a bit better. The only thing is, I don't know why there's no sound effect for um, picking up um, the white lilies. white lilies. You know, normally when you pick up an item, you get like a really cool sound. They don't have that in this oh, game. I've got no idea why. Maybe it got cold from the budget. Yeah. That's okay. I don't know. You sound pretty bummed about it. <laughs> oh, I don't know. It's, I'm just so used to it. It's like opening a chest and not getting the Zelda sound. I need that dopamine brownie. Ah! Okay, no, I think we can do this. Can we fall down here? No. Oh my god! 
Oh no! It's so fat! Get away from me! I do not have any cream puffs! Let's open this door. Okay, so examine. Oh, fuck me. Whoops. Alright, what secrets do you have down here? It all melted in the rain. And all the blight. Get down here. I can't get down here yet. So that's an ability on. Oh, unless. Let's try again. No. We haven't unlocked that yet. Just down here. So where? I, no, that's where I came from. Oh no. Oh yeah, that she does work. I like she stuns them as well. Oh. oh fuck, that was dumb. Ah, fucking birds. Oh, it's homing. Are you serious? Oh, whoops. Oh no! I misplayed! Gotcha! Leveled up again. Ah, uh, okay, we need to see if we can get that. I want that chest. So Granny obviously hasn't built his dice and spear yet. No, I have Ooh, broken music box. Slightly reduces damage received from enemies. An old lullaby still leaks out from the music box destroyed in the heat of battle. A note attached. Dear child, I hope you see I see you in my dreams. Can I attach that now? No. I guess. We can't go any further up. We have to go across now. But yeah, we do need to play Ori after. It's probably be Gris than Ori, I reckon. A spy's shack over yonder. Let's rest our weary bones. True Believer's Note. After the Blighted started to appear in Land's End, many religions quickly began to die out, including the True Way. Seeking hope, they many flocked to the White Priestess. It is likely that the way of the White Parish rose from there and spread amongst the people. Now I have a relic. Okay, so this takes up two slots. 
Uh, what else do you want? Let's enhance you. Don't have unlocked any more spirits? No, just the two of them. Oh, whoops, I have to save. Is there no auto save? Wait, I just I just noticed I had a um Oh, I have all my companions here. That's pretty cool. Including that random slug looking thing. Seems a path leads off from here. Shall we take a look? So we're at two pathways. 